Charlie Girls. Just another video for you. Um, I wanted to do something that you could use for summer. So um, it's what I call the lazy man rake and shake styling technique. So basically you don't have to be as involved, as thorough with your application and your um, technique. It's really just a matter of getting the, the right amount of product in your hair so that you don't miss any spots and just kind of letting your hair dry naturally in the sun or just, you know, air dried. So basically this is a style that won't last you as many days as the traditional rake and shake set will. So it's something that you can do if you know you're going to be re-wetting your hair tomorrow morning. So um, for instance, maybe after a workout or something like that, but just knowing that it's something you have to kind of always do, um, you know, more frequently than if you were to actually take the time and really be thorough with your application. So either way, whether it's summertime, whether it's a workout kind of thing, lifestyle kind of thing, whatever the case may be, this is the lazy man version. So I'm going to use the Hydrofusion Cream Styler. It's a softer hold. It's not going to give me as strong of a set and it'll actually elongate some of my curls, which is nice. So what I'm going to do is I'm literally just going to separate my hair into quadrants. So you can start either on the left or the right, doesn't matter, and you can do it to your part. So you can see how I already kind of have the part in place. So it's ear to ear forward, just like you do when you do the five sections of the rake and shake. And I'm just literally applying the product, so just smoothing it from roots to ends, like you do when you initially start your rake and shake application. The only difference is, is that we're not really raking it or shaking it. We're really just kind of raking it, but we're not really giving it that um, separation that the traditional raking will do. So again, just making sure you get it from roots to ends, evenly saturated. All the way like that. And then you're just going to take the back and split it down the, the center. So you'll get your two sections there. I'm doing about a quarter size amount in each section. So depending on how long your hair is or how thick it is, you may use a dime size or a nickel size or even more than a, qu a quarter size. But you'll feel it. You'll want your hair to feel nice and slick with product. This takes, what, maybe two or three minutes? Super easy. All the way. Not missing any spots. You'll know when you've missed a spot because it will be frizzy. So I, I give this um, styling technique to clients who are not really that savvy with their styling also. So that way they, they know that they can at least eliminate frizz with their curls, right? So it may not be a perfect styling set that you can achieve with the rake and shake or through me doing it for you, but at least you won't have frizz. So then I'm done applying the product and I'm literally just going to take my towel and scrunch bottom towards the roots. So this is going to give me more of an expanded look because I don't have so much definition which, you know, kind of like slims out the hairstyle. This is going to give me more of like a real beachy look. And that's it. So now I'll just air dry. If you wanted, you could even wrap your hair up in a ballerina bun and have it set and dry that way. That will really elongate the curl and give it even more of a wave if you have a tighter curl like I do. So who knows, I might do that. Um, but that's it. That's my lazy man rake and shake slash beachy, casual, curly look for the girl who doesn't want to invest too much time and effort. And you'll still get no frizz. Um, just make sure you take care of the hair, do your deep treatments, and you'll have better results. All right, see you next time for another curly tip. Thank you.